Hey guys, Pixelmills13 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to import music from a CD, any CD, on any audio CD, onto iTunes. This is, I, yeah, whatever. Um, anyways, uh, here's my CD, and what you're going to do is you're going to put it in, um, the thing that you put your CD in, I guess you want to call it, and I'm not sure why I just did that. Okay, put it in. And there you go. Now, if you go back to iTunes, something should pop up. This is right there. And should say, would you like to import uh, your CD? Get a whatever. And just press no. Just press no. What you're going to do is you're going to click off the songs that you want. What you don't want, you can always um, double click them to listen to them. And it shows you right up the top of there. Um, I'm actually going to take time to listen to them because I actually care about the CD. I'm not just doing it for a tutorial. And um, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys, um, I'm back. And uh, yeah, I actually want all of them. I didn't realize I'd want all of them. Anyways, when you're done, at the bottom right corner, right here, it should say import CD, and just click that, and it should have this orange thing right next to it, and it'll tell you the time remaining right here, and when you're done, like when it's, when it's done importing the song, it'll turn green, which it should in like, I don't know. Six seconds, five, four, and um, <clears throat> right now it should. And when it's done, it should have a little ding. I'll be right back when it's done. Um, and I'll what up? Whatever. I'll show you the ding if you, cause you know dings are awesome. Hey guys, I'm back. Um, and yeah, it took a bit much. It took a long time actually. Pretty much it took about maybe three and a half minutes. Um, like I said, you should hear that little ding. It should be about right now. Yeah, I saw this band live a couple months ago. And yeah, I don't know if you heard that or not. But when you're done importing, everything should have a check mark around it. Green check mark. And you should have heard that ding. If not, it doesn't really matter. Just press this button, eject. And if you look over here, yeah, it comes out. So you can just take it and you're pretty much done. Now you can find the album. It will not have album artwork. Um, I'll search for it. Okay, so it's right here. And what you can what you can do is you can just right click. Oops. You want to right click. Um, actually, you know what? I have to find it. I'll be right back when I find it. Okay, guys, I'm back once again, and I did find it. What you want to do is um, you want to right click on this, and you should see right here it says Get Album Artwork, and it should have a loading bar right there. Um, I'll be right back once again when it's done. <clears throat> okay guys, it's uh, the bar disappeared all of a sudden. And um, yes, it's it'll just show, that's, that's what it is. You can also go on Google and um, you can search it and you can copy and paste the picture what you're gonna do. If you're gonna do that, go to get info. Just press yes. <clears throat> you're gonna go to um you'll see artwork right here, just paste it to here. So you know, I'm gonna check that off, but and then you just press OK. And you should have it. But anyways guys, that's my tutorial on how to import music from a CD to iTunes. Um uh rate, comment, and subscribe, and this is Kixnigles13 signing off.